Hi, my name is Brian Eiberg, and I'm a classical pianist from Boston, Massachusetts. And I just w wanted to talk for a few minutes today um, before I do my music recording to let everyone know a little bit about me and um, just to try to kind of face the camera and be a little bit candid about what I'm doing in my video today. Um, so basically, um, today I'm going to be recording a piece called Reverie. It's a piece by the composer Claude Debussy, who was a wonderful composer. He wrote a lot of really beautiful music. Um, and so I'm going to be playing from some music that I got from a, uh, the daughter of a concert pianist that she, um, when I was in Michigan, I think it was the first time I was there um, before I actually went to school there. I went to school at the University of Michigan um, and got my master's degree there in piano performance at the School of Music. I think now it's called the School of Music, Theater, and Dance. And um, But when I was in junior high school, I was at my great aunt and uncle's house in Ann Arbor, Michigan. And I went across the street to some friends of theirs that lived across the street and I played the piano. And um, there was a lady there named Shirley. And um, I can't remember how we were related to her, but her um, father was a concert pianist. His name was Walter Wood. And he lived in Cincinnati. And he was a dance accompanist at the University of, um, not the University of Cincinnati, but um, the music school there in Cincinnati. And um, so he played the piano for years and she just gave me piles and piles of sheet music, which I, <clears throat> I told my wife, I think I should get rid of this music. It's just old. And, and so a few weeks ago we went through some boxes and I looked through it and I was like, I told my wife, I said, I can't throw this music away. Um, it's just really beautiful classical music and original editions of things that are really pretty. Uh, one of the books I have is this book that I'm going to show you here in a second. I'll have to turn the camera around for you to see it. Um, but it's an old book and I open it up and I rediscovered this piece by Debussy that I don't think it's played that much. It's called Reverie and it's just a beautiful piece and I'll show you the book here in a second. And I'm also going to record it and play it in this video too. And um, so I hope you enjoy it. I'm going to be actually, I don't know the piece really well. It's a fairly easy classical piece, so it's not super hard, but I still will make a few mistakes because um, I've never really seriously worked on it. But it's still really pretty and I can play it mostly pretty well. I think you'll enjoy listening to it and maybe, you know, you can see where I make mistakes and things and kind of notice, you know, if you have that same problem in that same section or what. I'm a piano instructor too. I teach at two music schools in the Boston area and I, I love teaching piano. I love the piano. I love classical music and jazz. I think those are my two favorite kinds of music, my two uh, that I really like to play. Um, I'm, I feel like I know classical music really well. I feel like I went really far in classical music. Um, jazz, I feel like I'm kind of taught myself what I know about jazz and I'm still learning. Um, and it's, it's a hard, hard kind of music to play to really know all the chord extensions and the upper, um, whatever they're called. <laughs> and, um, so anyway, and I do like musical theater and I also play, uh, popular music too. And anything you can play on the piano, I love it. So anyway, I'm going to go ahead and, and turn this camera around and show you the music book so you can see what it looks like. And maybe you can see my piano too. And I'll see you in a minute. Well, here's the book that I was just talking about. And here's the piece of music that I was talking about. So as you can see, it's quite an old book. I'm really trying to be very careful with it. It's just a beautiful uh, beautiful addition. So I don't know if I can turn this without, I wanted to show you the table of context. I don't want to lose my place, but you know, a lot of classical musicians are very serious about what they do, but I wanted to show, which is great, but look, it has these listed by classic compositions, Beethoven, Mozart, Gluck, Hummel, um, Gounod, 
but also it, it lists them as modern compositions, which is interesting. Grieg is considered a modern competition in this book. And then uh, I think the Reverie is under the modern, which is interesting, Reverie by Debussy. And it's also interesting that there are several um, Reveries in here too. And then if you look over here, we have light compositions. So I don't know if there are, um, I don't see any famous, oh, Strauss right there is in that one. Yeah, so the light stuff isn't as uh, well known these days, I don't think. I haven't heard of those composers. But anyway, I'm going to go ahead and record this piece for you, and I hope you enjoy listening to it. I'll see you in a minute.